So we know where they are. They are at the edge of the wilderness or the edge of the desert, the big desert that is known as the Sahara Desert. They're coming west. Phil High Road, the place where sage or sedge, sedge or reed grows. You see this word that they put there, Phil High Road. What they're hiding in there is that they come to a place on the edge of that wilderness named Phil High Road. And what happens there, the significance of that place is a place where the reed grows. So you get the picture with the reed and the water and the reed. We're going to look very closely at what happened here. This is the word we want to look into the Strong's and see what is hidden in this word. And you'll be surprised. Strong's H6367, Phil I wrote, you can drop the H, a place of reed or the sage. Now, we know that reed is very frequent in the Bible. The journey that they took is what we're tracing. When they journeyed from Ramses and they come to the Sudan, to Sukkot, they continue their journey and they come to a place called Etam. So they are heading for West Africa. The Red Sea is on the east. They are heading on the west. So they're never going near to the Red Sea. Then which sea is being mentioned? You'll see what they did. 